Hey there guys, Andrew Dacosta here, EK Jenna Bro 95, coming at you guys with a, another video. So today, guys, we have Seahawks theme team gameplay. We got two players on the theme team for you guys I want to showcase. Uh, now, I sorry I took a little bit to get this video out. I was very, very exhausted yesterday. I, I played in the game that I played on stream. I, I played so bad. I, I, I feel like I couldn't showcase that because of how bad it was. Uh, first off, we got the MCS 90 overall Tariq Woolen. Now, you can only get this card by viewbotting the EA MCS Championship streams that they decide to put out because for whatever reason ea wants us to care about that shit we don't please stop forcing us to give a crap about it we don't care about it ea sports we we just don't uh but 94 speed 93 excel 92 zone coverage 92 man 91 press i think this card is really 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 good though uh, otherwise the only complaint about this for me is the fact that he can't get pick artists now i'm not gonna get mad at john beast for this uh, I know some people were probably, I think some people might be a little bit PO'd about that. I'm not, because I don't think he thought that EA was going to just not make it to where we could have pick artists on this card. Uh, so, that being said, I'm not really going to be too PO'd at it. Um, also, he does get all the zone KOs. He does get flat zone, uh, mid zone. Uh, oops, I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Uh, he also does get deep end zone KO if you want to play him at safety, which I've seen a couple people do, which is not a bad idea. Also, does get some route KOs, too. Uh, because he is, does have a really, really high man coverage. Uh, and then he does get a special ability bucket with deep out KO for 3 AP. I unfortunately cannot find a way to squeeze this on the team. Uh, once I do find a way to squeeze this on the team, I'll probably use it for a little bit just to see how good it plays. Uh, but sadly, I can't figure out a way to squeeze this on the team. So, uh, But that is the overview of Tariq Woolen. Now we move on to the game day Thanksgiving player, Julian Love. Now, Julian Love... Uh, really solid card, actually. 91 speed, 91 zone coverage. I am actually using the rare uh, free strategy item. You know, not, not like it's not an actual free strategy item. It is a strategy item called free, which is boost safety zone coverage by three uh, on both strong and free safeties. Uh, so Julian Love, 92, 91 speed, 92 acceleration, 91 zone coverage. I think this Julian Love is pretty solid as a coverage safety. As a user, I don't think he's that good, to be completely honest, because he is only 5'11", um, and you're not going to really get too much out of the run game for him because he does have pretty bad block shot. He has solid pursuit, uh, but he also doesn't have very, very high hit power as well, being only 60. And plus two, with everybody having Lurk Artists on their team now, I think it just wouldn't make sense to have safeties at linebacker anymore, unless you're just really, really, really crushed for AP, and you want to save the one AP that comes with a Lurk Artist and having uh, a free, like, basically, you know what I mean? Um, but... Uh, the thing with this Julian Love, though, is I do actually suspect this card will go up to a 91 overall uh, because the conditions for this overall card are not that bad. Seattle needs to force a turnover, which they are pro they probably will do against the Niners. Um, Brock Purdy has not been taking care of the ball recently. Now, he did play really, really good against the Jaguars, and at the time we're going to be recording this video, the Niners have not played their next game, which I don't know who the Niners' next game is. I'll put a... Uh, they all put up who it is going to be on the next uh, next game for their next game. Uh, but Seattle forcing a turnover, I think, is something that can happen. Uh, and then Julian Love getting two tackles, I also think will happen as well. Let me actually take my face cam out of the way so you could see it. Uh, that's the chat box. Uh, where is my webcam? So there it is. Uh, see, you see right there, first forced turnover and Julian Love getting himself getting two tackles. I think both are very possible. Uh, Julian Love is very active on the defensive side of the ball with... Um, with the Seahawks defense, uh, but yeah, so I do think this card will go up to a 91 overall once Thanksgiving is done. Um, now, would I recommend picking up this card? Honestly, this is one of the few I would honestly say yes. Now, I'm not saying that because this card is good. I'm saying that because Blitz is going to be around the corner next week, and with these Thanksgiving cards, um, they are only available to be picked up for sets until the night of thanksgiving once the, or whatever i think it's like the day before or whatever uh but once the thanksgiving game like once thanksgiving comes around for our american for the american friends out there uh this card will not be able to be picked up via a set you will only be able to pick them up on the auction market so it may not be a bad idea to just say fuck it and pick them up if you really want to um so uh also the safety position for the seahawks is really really good right now we did get um uh, Ryan Neal for the Division Dynasty a week ago. So um, if that factors into your decision, it does. Uh, me personally, um, pick, I'm going to keep Julian Love uh, for at least the current day roster. But with that being said, and after a decently long intro, enjoy the gameplay. 
All right, we're back. There we go. Sorry about that. So I had to get some water for myself. That's his top three. Johnny Manziel, DK, and Marlon Humphrey. Yeah, Russ, Lockett, and Reek for my top three. All right, cool. You, Jerry. There we go. And again, John Randall once again breaks right through and he doesn't get him. The guy ran fucking read option the like all three plays, and for some reason the inside stuff shed twice, got to the backfield, but didn't get the tackle. Jo joyful. You, you just you love to see it. You love to see it. Oh, okay, so not all, so you, you definitely are an annoying sack of shit. Okay, cool. Cool. Okay. He must have played man that time. He did. He did. I was not prepared for uh I wasn't fully prepared for man on that play. And JSN is supposed to be running a crossing route and he just doesn't run it. Good catch, JSN. Fucking making up for that bullshit ass. <laughs> He's just showing blitz. He's not actually sending it. Now watch next play. He's going to fucking send it. I had JSN on the fucking corner. I should have threw that corner out. Get the fucking ball out, Russ. Good catch, Metcalf. There we go. Fuck off me. A unless I just had, unless I just thinking like the play that I called was different than the one I thought I had was calling. It's just weird because we're just gonna spot him seven. We're we're just gonna spot him seven again, huh? Uh, we're just going to spot the guy seven again. Th this is what we're doing. Finally, John Randall makes the fucking play. He actually caught a play action that time. And Eric Berry just gave that up. Okay, cool. Eric just gave that up for whatever reason what he's going to be calling in the next drive, so I'm going to... Alright, so I know what I'm going to try and do. Uh...
I forgot I have one timeout left. There we go. Trade tokens for for Barry. That's that's just crazy. That's that's why he's getting open like that. It's because Eric Barry is so fucking slow, actually. It's because Eric Barry is so fucking slow. I think he has like eighty eight speed now. Like, that's not- I'm, I'm right there. Like, I'm literally running over there. That should have been fucking picked off. That should have been picked off. I feel like I need to get some carries on the run game going to keep him, uh, to keep this guy a little honest. Good catch, DK. Catch Jason. Right over your pass rusher's head. No fucking shot, that's a breakup. There's no shot, that's a fucking breakup. Just gonna give me the curl route all fucking game, huh, buddy? Let's go. And dude, just get five fucking minutes. Oh my goodness. Five fucking minute drive, guys. Good play, Clowny. Or was that Crowder? I think that was Crowder, yeah. We're still running read option down seven with just a, a two minute warning to go. We're still running read option. We're, we're still running read option with just under the two minute warning. Fucking first and 10. I thought it was fourth down. Uh, I, I came down a little too bit more, a uh, too bit aggressively on the play fake. I came down a little too aggressively. If I was there, if I was lurking a little bit over the middle, I probably wouldn't have had that. Okay, cool. Dumbass. This isn't a guarantee, though. There are ways to, like, cheese this nonsense. He said he totally fucked it up, too. 
Oh, uh, let's see. He's got two timeouts. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought, buddy. GG. Well, I mean, there's a gameplay.